And right, class, well, I don't have to tell you about the importance of polygons in geometry. Why does learning about polygons have to be so boring? Oh, who's that? I'm not expecting anybody. Polygons are awesome! It's Matt with Matthew. So I can't even know if I'm here. I'm here with Rebecca. I'm Joe Gatto from Pikes with Jokers, and you're watching Matt with Matthew. You're watching Matt with Matthew. You're watching Matt with Matthew. Welcome, Math Teachers. I am Pythagoras of Samos. Everybody's learning math, and they're learning about it in a fun way. Because girls know all about that math, about that math. They're really good. They're all about that math, about that math. Matthew Bay Ranavond, math and science coordinator for the district, is getting kids interested in math through music video. Teachers like seeing them, sharing them with the kids, as well as the kids like seeing that, because they say, oh, I know that math concept, or wow, that looks like really fun the way they're doing math, because math isn't always fun. What is the value The goal of, of making these math music videos is to really increase the students' interest and engagement in math. Oh, control is short. Time! Time! This will form a right triangle with the distance from home to second base being the hypotenuse of the right triangle. Okay, so using the theorem a squared plus b squared equals c squared, we can find the distance from home to second base. Exactly. She's trying to steal. fixed mindset and there's growth mindset. With fixed mindset, kids say, I can't do math, I hate math, and they believe that they don't have the ability to do math. If you have a growth mindset, you believe that you can do the math. Teach me like you do, teach, teach, teach me like you do, don't just show me two plus two, don't just show me two plus two. Let's start with our first question. It's a math multiple choice question. Here we go. I think it's C52. Now how confident are you? Do you want to use one of your lifelines now or do you feel like you know it? I think I'm pretty confident. You're pretty confident? Is that your final answer? Yeah. And that's correct. Uh, who's this? I am Matthew Bronovan, the math coordinator. Who are you? Hi. I think it's time for you to begin to understand the Pythagorean theorem. Step one, find the corner that's 90 degrees, cause a right triangle has one of these. Step two, Take an adjacent side, multiply it by itself, and set it aside. Step three, 